skateboarding, a sport that will make its debut in the Tokyo 2020 Olympics, pencaxilat and the ever-reliable boxing, grabbed the spotlight for the Philippines on Wednesday in the 2018 Asian Games. Margie Dittle, who used to cut classes just to engage in her hobby, made a head-turning performance in the street event by beating Japanese Isakaya and Indonesian Bungas Nimas during competitions held in the co-host city of Palembang. Dittle, 19, got 30.4 points for the gold, while Kaya was handed 25 points to settle for the silver and Nimas settled for the bronze with 19. 8 points. A pencaxilat bronze was also added to the growing collection of the Philippines earlier in the day, thanks to Almade Dibabat in the men's singles, pencax fourth following three other bronzes. With Didal's feet, the Philippines now has a decent haul of four golds and 13 bronzes, a tally that puts it at 16th place, just behind host and fourth Indonesia, 27 22 33, 10th place Thailand, 9 13 34 and 14th Malaysia, 489. The other golds by the Philippines were delivered by lifter Hiddle and Diaz, golfer Yuka Seso and the women's golf team, while the others' bronzes aside from Pencax 4 were provided by Taekwondo, 3, Washu, 2, and one apiece from BMX Cycling, Jiu-Jitsu, Golf, and Karate. In the ring, the Filipino fighters have been assured of two bronze medals after light fly Carlo Palom fashioned out a 4-1 win over Kazakhstan's Termitas Jusipov on Wednesday afternoon to join fly Rojan Layden in the semis that gets going Friday. A third Filipino, middle humor Felix Marshall, was slated to fight at 7 p.m. of Wednesday with a win assuring himself as well of a bronze. My opponent was a veteran, and I had to give everything I had," said Palam, 20, who was 10 years younger than the crafty Kazakh. Palam will face Amit Pangal of India in the semi-finals following his 5-0 win over Kim Jang-ryong of North Korea.